is up guys trim tax here and today I'm doing another video on this video episode I'm going to show you my my typical base build this is what I like to do especially on a uh, primitive servers where you basically don't have any guns I don't know why I've added sentries it's just something that, that I felt like doing you could have them there if you're on like some sort of other server where you have guns and all that and sentries but yeah you can always add your high external gates you will need tool cupboards to uh, try and cover all those add metal barricades if you want so I'm going to show you this is the only way you can get in and out of the base the rest of it is just honeycombed or you can do like triangle honeycomb as well I just uh, thought I might as well not do that but the sides here you've got um, some watchtowers you can also make those taller but I decided not to so then I can have a all around view with these things here so uh, you'd, you'd uh, build some twig uh, twig floors here destroy them once you go offline and then you make your way through here this can just be you know bottom this is the first floor basically to look out of and uh, you either have a ladder hatch or you can have stairs this can be the furnace room the second floor uh, the third floor is chest room I don't know why I ain't got no stairs there top floor is sniper tower there were some original well, there were originally some uh, pillars well some watch towers here that went up but he just filled the entire thing and it didn't look good. So uh, basically, I got these triangle things here, so then you can have like you can look down at all angles. So yeah, or I could do this. Or you could do this and like just build up and have like your windows, etc. Something like that. Uh, look pretty cool. Make sure you like don't make these windows because like that's just oh rubbish. But not rubbish. I mean uh, pointless. Well, just, unless you want to look at each other. Yeah, and probably have like. But I'm I'm a good base designer. I I really do like building. I don't mind if I get raided. Well, of course I mind being raided. But the one thing I hate is people offline raiding me. That's the only thing that I hate. <coughs> Uh, I'd rather be online and defend my base rather than be offline and then just destroy my entire base. So look, this is a tool cupboard radius. You got one in the middle of this, or you can put it wherever you want. Can't find it. Somewhere in there. And you got some at the edges here, which cover all that. This, and then you can also uh, have one here, I guess. I'm also going to be having my own server as well. Uh, don't know what to call it yet. I'm still adding some mods into it. Uh, I can make it vanilla if you want me to, but I don't really see the point in making it vanilla because you know you ha you own your own server to make it not vanilla, or else people just rather go on official servers. But when people do make vanilla servers, I see it's kind of the point why they do that. You know, it's just because uh, on that vanilla server they have admins on it. Like someone owns a vanilla server that's got an admin on it. So that's a, that's okay I guess. But uh, I don't prefer to I don't prefer to play on vanilla servers on other people's vanilla servers. I just don't see the point. I might as well play on a vanilla server if I wanted to play on something that doesn't have any times on it. So uh, I might be adding times fifty or times hundred, you know, whatever you ask for I will do. But um currently I'm probably gonna have like twelve people on there, that's all my mates and all that. We are going to do like fun games, something like clan wars, etc. Um, might even do a king thing like roleplay. It's definitely going to be roleplay. If you don't like roleplay, then just don't bother to be a roleplay person. It should be someone else, but I think roleplay is pretty fun. So yeah, uh, this is only a short video, especially to advertise my server. Uh, this is probably what my admin base is going to look like. This looks pretty cool. So yeah, uh, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe. Oh, one more thing. Also, just add pillars on every floor. It just supports it so much. So though, as I said, guys, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.